Snazzy, dirty hat from all this farm work. Good, now you can go. Now I can go. Now I can go. She says. Okay. So what are we? What are we talking about? We have uh, an update on the solar power system. Yeah. So a few days ago, um, exactly four business days ago, I'm counting business days. Um, a gentleman from Sunrun came out, and his name was Avail Lopez, and he um, inspected the system with the city inspector, and they said everything looked great, and now they need to send their information to uh, Encore, who is the service provider in the DFW area. Right? The electric, so the electric power company. Yeah, the electric power company. And they will then uh, inspect or do whatever they do and give us what is called a PTO. And PTO is permission to operate. Permission to operate. And it not only is permission to operate, but it's also um, in having that gives us the ability to sell excess power back to the power companies. Yeah, so yeah. still tied to the grid, but what we generate goes back to the power or the utility company. So uh, they just needed to make sure that our system was uh, set up correctly to do that. And compatible with Compatible with them and, and us. Yeah. And um, so I, David was at home when the inspectors came out. So I made a little video and asked him to just say what it, what, he, um, what he was looking for. What is he looking for? How does it work? Um, just so that, um, number one, David could see what he did while David was off at work. And for you guys, if you have put any questions on how it all works, um, so here's the video. Here we go. My name is Eval Lopez with Sun Run Solar Installations. I'm the inspections coordinator for the North Texas branch. Here in Texas and um, just want to have a quick uh, one two three steps actually to let you know how our system works this is a battery wall pack uh, Tesla system included with uh, a panel solar PV solar system all together working from our transfer switch automatically doing all that uh, power transferring from this panels right here on the back and also transferring over to the battery in the event of uh, an emergency or the power outage you will be able to or the the system will be able to lit up or supply power to the panel which is the, the main panel in the back which became battery backup system now after that the batteries on the inside, if you want to take a quick look, we can go. Here is the panel, the battery essential loads panel right here. The, pretty much taking care of all the house. In the event of a powered outage, that box that I just showed you will uh, tell these batteries right here to go ahead and uh, let go of the energy so all these circuits here will be able to keep on going well everybody else around the house on the other neighborhood in the neighborhood will be without power so these are the Tesla batteries right here that we call wall packs and equipment ready for uh, to be turned on as soon as we pass our uh, PTO approval from the utilities having jurisdiction in the area here are the panels, of which of is into the outdoor, yes. or which are a handful of them, and the other module here, box, meaning the brain of the solar system panel, and phase combiner box, which has all these panels that you see here, 
and a, com a computer brain right here which is communicating with that other uh, transfer switch box from Tesla which is providing all that energy for that batteries to be charged up off from the solar energy captured by the solar panels and uh, pretty much that will be the whole protocol in the sense of equipment being operating as we pass the so-called PTO permission to operate from utilities which is coming soon after we close the final inspection report right that will be awesome all right yes ma'am any more questions um yeah i can't think of any but i thank you very much for any time yes ma'am my pleasure and really uh, my surprise too to be here in, in on video to show off the steps of our final yeah. uh, inspection report and or protocol in the last one step meeting the interconnection with utilities will be happening pretty soon within five to ten days weather like this as I always say might be less than five days so at least we know it's coming soon yeah yes great thank My you very much. much you're very welcome right. All right, well, we hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, the little update on how the solar power installation is going. Yep, and today is, like I said, day four of 10. Possibly 10. Yes, um, we've had a holiday, so that ate up some of the days. So um, anyway, we hope you got something out of that. Stay tuned for the rest of the saga, turning this brick into actual power plant. Actual power plant. That'll be awesome. And in the meantime, we're cooking in the sun oven. So be sure and, and check out oven. that video Speaking of us. Speaking of solar, where is it? The solar powered sun oven right there. Cooking our dinner. Yep. So watch for that upcoming video as well. Yeah. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <clears throat>